Hello Virgo, welcome to your monthly reading. This is a quick and general reading for the month of May. Virgo, what I do see here, be prepared for the unexpected. And this could be that you could surprise yourself because this is like unexpected ways of feeling. Maybe it was, you know, an example would be you never believed in something or, okay, you never believed in astrology. You never, th you thought that, you know, you didn't like whatever and you had some kind of different belief. All of a sudden, your interest in astrology gets like, bam, you know? Um, so there's a change of interest and this change of spirituality. Um, I have to say that you're spiritually evolving and there is some spiritual detours. Um, so this is like, you know, it's a spiritual path and there's ups and downs. So um, sometimes we don't get what we want. We get what, um, you know, the universe brings us because it is pushing us into another path. There is some spiritual changes. You have some uh, a spiritual tower here, but you have to also believe in yourself. So believe in yourself. And that's a sense of being prepared for the changes and that you may not even, you know, you may look back later and say how much I have changed the way I believe in things, the way I feel and, and things, you know, in, in my life. All right. So I do see that some of you are headed into a spiritual career here. Love from the past is showing up here. So this could be thinking of someone from the past or how it used to be reminiscing. So I do see that love and compassion is important. You're a little bit scattered here. You only have four stones. So this is, again, building um, and patience. All right. And there's a focus on your security and family. Um, the home is kind of in the gray here, too. So there's something that needs to be addressed. But at the same time, um, your house is made out of glass. It's like maybe you're thinking that people don't know what's going on or something, but more people are aware of it than what you think um, is the best I can explain here. There's going to be a lot of adjustments here. Okay, so we're seeing a lot of adjustments um, here as well. Um, I do see for some of you, this is like you've got a great idea or your um, um, this could be um, opportunities or messages and use for like to expand, uh, to, um, to get out of a comfort zone, but there's some fear involved. Okay. So I do feel that energy. It's time to kind of like, um, sometimes, you know, the universe comes in and takes something away. So it would push us to get what we want or to redirect us where we want to go. So that kind of energy. Okay. It's like dealing with some kind of fear for some of you. There could be some message that's coming in. Okay. And, um, not sure if it's good or bad, but there is an important message that may come in or some important news. All right. So I do feel that energy as well. You have the right idea, but there's going to be some adjustments and um, detours along the way. There can be some significant official news coming in. Um, there is some very fast moving energy. You may have to think on your feet here. So I do feel that energy too. So this could be spiritual epiphanies um, or just some news that does come in. Now, seeing is believing because I do see that there um, not everything that you hear is going to be true. There is some deception involved. There is um, sometimes for some of us, this is just like paranormal type of experiences or spiritual epiphanies or uh, dreams we don't understand and we try to analyze them. So I do feel that energy. A lot of you could be dealing with some important documents and paperwork this um, this um, month. OK, so I see that energy, too, for some of you are experimenting with scientific projects. So I do feel that, too. I do feel that there is some deception around, too. Um and this is, um, it's a sneaky energy too. So not everybody's telling you everything. You're not telling everyone everything too. So you're kind of like hiding something as well. For some of you, you may um, find out some invaluable information that could be kind of dangerous, I want to say. Maybe you find out a, fa a company secret or something. Um, I'd be careful what I do say or what I know. Okay. So I do see that, um, energy too. So that is for some out there as well. So this is a lot of scientific, um, work too. So I'm seeing that you may be learning something new and even spiritual studies may be coming through here. Um, you there's a big review on the way you've seen things, heard things, believed in things, Reviewing where you want to spend your time, money, energy, and where you're going to invest in the future. I do see some of you could be a little bit tired of your work or 
Um, you know, I'm not happy with my job. I'm not happy with that. But I do see you're going to have to make some decisions. I see some choices there, too, as well. Some of you will be making some important um, investments for the future, too, that will slowly grow and will be profitable in the future. I do see that. But you need to believe in yourself somehow, too. So I do feel that, too. Something long term and practical here is showing up. All right. So I do see that. Um, some of you will be delving into a lot of prayer and your prayers will be heard. Okay, and they will, there is a significant wish or something that may come to fruition, but it may come with a delay. So delays are going to be in your favor. This is divine timing as well, which does indicate as well to me, spiritual changes, or you may get little sparks of miracles or little breadcrumbs. So you know where you're, you know, headed. So I'm seeing that again, you need to believe in yourself. That is a strong message here. Travel is definitely involved here. Okay, I do see a lot of you making progress, transportation, maybe some of you be buying a car, road trip, or this is travel, and you may be um, traveling with someone. This could be a trusted um, friend or something like that. For some of you, are just going through a shamanic journey. Definitely, this is just um, a spiritual travel and, and a movement. You are moving ahead, and this is a mindful progress, too. It is important to create harmony, diplomacy this uh, month and try to build um, harmonious relationships as well with others, okay? Um, so I do see here travel for a lot of you or it's just spirit. Maybe you're going to go on a spiritual retreat or there is some travel showing up too. And I do feel not all of you are going to be traveling alone. You'll be traveling with someone as well. So there, you're definitely on a journey um, one way or another. So seeing that energy and believing in yourself is very important this month. All right, Virgo, that is your reading for the month of May. Have a fabulous May. Bye for now.